I had a look at uh, Max Kaiser's silver sale site. I was wondering if he adjusted his price downward yet. But no, you're looking at a uh, one ounce Canadian silver maple. Just an ordinary silver maple, not one in a wildlife series. Forty-seven fifty-nine. Forty-seven fifty-nine. Hasn't changed one penny. And uh, looking at spot price of silver right now, it's sitting at twenty-nine ninety-one. So over sixty percent over spot, almost nineteen dollars over spot. What is Max doing here? And it makes me uh, wonder about his credibility too. Uh, it's good to have a healthy skeptical mind because uh, <laughs> I just look at this and I say to myself, forty-seven fifty-nine. Why is he not adjusting the price down? Now, if you just look at an ordinary vendor, uh, this is CanesvilleCoins.com, the same exact coin or very close to the same coin. I don't know if it's a different year, but this is the 2012 Canadian Silver Maple, 3137 bank wire or 3225 credit card price. So it's a little over spot because it's a maple, uh, it's a Canadian 9999 49s coin. But uh, that's quite a bit of difference between his 47.59. So uh, I wonder about this guy. <laughs> I don't know, maybe some people are really hardcore followers of him, but uh, I'm not. I'm not because uh, he reminds me of typical uh, playing to the crowd type people. Tells me everything about the banks, there's the evil people and all this type of stuff. But uh, why is he selling silver for this much money? That really is, uh, you know, talking about the banksters, I mean, his price is so far over the average ordinary silver vendor, it's ridiculous. Uh, I'd like to be able to sell him uh, back silver Canadian maple leaves for thirty nine ninety five. How is that? But I'm sure he wouldn't take it. You know, that's what I would see. But, you know, if you just email them and says, hey, you want to buy some silver back for about thirty nine ninety? Um I'm sure your answer would be a no or a no response. So uh makes you wonder what he's really about because I can't see this guy does not see this on his silverkaiser.net website as of today, which is uh 12 2011 December 19, 2011, Monday, that he's selling coins for 4759 where competitive vendors are selling for around 31 or 32 and the spot price is below $29 an ounce. So, um, you know, unfortunately all the heroes in uh, the silver arena are probably not and uh, they're out for number one. That's what you just have to figure. But I still say, as I was illustrating on that last video, the price relationship between uh, silver and oil uh, there is a strong correlation when oil goes into a bull market and I think oil is going to go into a serious bull market in 2012 but um, as far as some of these absolutely high predictions about you know silver you know when you're seeing a gold break fifty dollars everybody's gonna be saying it's gonna go right to a hundred you know I almost think it's not going to I think it's gonna have another serious pullback and um, you know, that's when everybody gets all the emotions going and it's going to go this high and go that high. But at one point in time, I think it's going to be several hundred dollars, no problem. I'm not sure about the thousand, but it could easily be four or five hundred dollars. I think that's ultimately where it's going to come out to. But uh, as far as Max Kaiser, man, I don't know. This guy, I, I was looking at this over the last weeks or so and I check it every once in a while but I had to point out I mean even after today as silver hasn't been this low in quite some time he's still holding on to selling silver at 47.59 I wonder how many buyers he's got at that rate that's that's pretty uh, to me that's an unfair price that's an unfair price nobody's charging that high I wonder how many people are actually buying off of this site it makes me wonder